3,000 miles and four days driving, heading to the How of Ann Build, folks. What adventures await me? Will I break down? Maybe they won't even let me into the U.S. I don't know. I tell you, it's going to be interesting. I'm going to going to put a shirt on cuz you know the border patrol people they uh they might not like the topless guy coming through and uh you know I'm going to put a pretty shirt on for the border patrol shaved up looking good but after uh after I get into the states I'm trying a true van life what do you call it mission uh challenge I'm not sure but I'm going to see how long I can wear the same shirt for without stinking I don't know, two days, three days, maybe I can get all the way to the van build with the same shirt. We'll find out. Stay tuned, guys. Oh, I found something chewy on Route 66. You might want to see that, too. Bubba Box Truck Corey! Well, here we are, getting on 401. Off to the How of Van Build. What do you think, Dopey? What about you, Har Har? Long drive. Long drive, girls. Oh, first thing fell. Got me some, some muffins for the ride and an apple. We're set. The U.S. border, guys. We're almost there. Pahrump, Nevada, just down the road, right? Coming into New York State, Watertown, New York. Well, we're heading to secondary screening. The fun continues. Well, we are off on our way. Pahrump, Nevada, here we come. Hope the dogs didn't steal my food. I forgot a muffin sitting on the dashboard. It's uh, probably, oh, look at that. It's still there, still there. Move over, let me in. Day two, guys, filling up. Cheapest diesel yet, three bucks. But my question, can, you, can anyone tell me why is diesel more expensive than gas in the US because diesel is less refined than gasoline so it should be cheaper less involved in making it I don't understand maybe someone can explain it to me what do you think dopey what do you think I don't care dad I just want to go well we made it to Columbus Ohio anyway few more hours of driving to go today maybe uh, maybe we'll make st. Louis that's the goal I don't know if it'll happen but every day that doesn't end in a wreck or a breakdown or a flat tire is a good day well back on the road it's what little after four I gotta get through Columbus before the traffic gets too bad I'm on the 270 uh, bypass, so uh, it's not looking too terrible. Glad I'm not an hour later, though. So uh, best to uh, get going before it gets worse. Right, Dopey? Where's Har Har? What do you think? Oh, I know. I know. You want to go, too? We got to get to Pahrump, Dad. We got to get to Pahrump. Now, how many times do you pass a tank driving down the freeway, guys? First time for me. Starting out day three, guys, and we're driveway camping, visiting friends here in St. Louis. Had a good night last night. Now it's time to hit the road. It's gonna be a long day. I gotta do, oh, 1,200 miles minimum. I'm falling behind, but it's sure why it's nice visiting a friend here in St. Louis, Missouri, and now I'm hitting the road. It was, uh, it was a great night. Slept uh, in a 
First night, I slept at a, just a run-of-the-mill rest stop in Pennsylvania. Second night here. Third night, who knows? Nice little neighborhood. Served me just fine for a night's sleep. Well guys, ran into a snag. We're enjoying Route 66, but not in a good way. We, uh, well, we're broken down. I don't know why, but serpentine belt broke again, did last year guy uh, was helping me here a bit says that there's uh, there's some burrs on the pulleys and he thinks that that's probably what's causing the belts to, to snap but nonetheless it's Sunday I'm over here at the Route 66 hidden treasures shop and I can't go anywhere until I get a new belt which I can't get today I've got a couple of them that we tried but not the right size. This one's from a big block Chevy gas engine that I was told is the same size and would work. It's six inches too short. It won't fit. If I avoid, if I go around the, the AC bypass pulley, then it's too big. So there's just no way of putting it on where, where it's gonna work. That sucks. So what I can do is drink a little whiskey, a little Mike's Hard Lemonade, and uh, enjoy the features of the area. Can you see that little garage over there? Does that look familiar, anyone? Maybe we'll take a closer look, but that is the garage that was used to film the first Cars movie here on Route 66 in Santa Rosa, New Mexico. Since I have not much to do but drink, maybe I'll walk over. I'm gonna have to watch the Cars movie again, the first one, just to see if uh, these boys are screwing with me or not. But apparently, if you look at the face of this fire truck, it's uh, recognizable down here. So we've got the garage in the beginning before it was fixed up. And then next door, and then after it's fixed up, was this building. So I don't know. Are they pulling my leg? I spent too long. I gotta watch the first Cars movie just to figure it out. I guess that's what I'll do tonight. Might as well check it out. Gotta do something for the night. So, I'm not gonna make it to the Howe Van build on time. I'm gonna be two, three days late because the chance of them having this size belt in stock in this little tiny town, slim to none. So I gotta wait till the morning, call the auto parts store, See what they have to say. Chew is just finishing up, guys. Blew another serpentine belt. I gotta figure out why that's happening. Been stuck here in Santa Rosa, New Mexico for day and a half, two days, something like that. But uh, met a new friend. Chewy helped me here. Now I've learned how to change it myself. I know what I'm doing if it happens again. And I gotta tell you, the mechanic right next door, not so helpful. I went in there, they said that they could help me. You know, I'm gonna pay them, of course. They take it apart, and then they start yelling at each other in Spanish, and then eventually they tell me, I gotta leave. And if I could push my truck out of their property, that would be good, too. Well, we did. We, we did. But thankfully, Chewy was working right next door over here at Hidden Treasures, and, uh, you know, he hooked me up. He helped me out. We of course. Had a couple drinks last night, waiting for the auto parts store to open. <laughs> And uh, now I'm ready to hit the road, but check out his handiwork. He painted this sign. Pretty nice little 66 logo. 
and he's uh, he's living in his fifth wheel next in the driveway doing some work here and uh, I'm sure glad I met him yep Chewie's brother I, I didn't catch your name yeah, if anyone's uh, in the Santa Rosa, New Mexico area and needs some handyman work, give uh, give them a call. 575-512-7784. Best handyman in Santa Rosa, New Mexico. So we're getting back on the road. The truck is running. The belt only cost 40 bucks. Chewy helped me get it on. So hopefully we can make it to the Howe Van build later today. But right now it's time to roll I'm already a day late for the how a van build don't ever go there people uh, I don't care how desperate you are just don't do it well we made it guys last night we camped at the Pahrump Walmart right here Let's head over to the build site. It's about time to get going. See what's happening. Long drive. Glad I made it. Looking forward to a day that doesn't involve a thousand miles of driving. We're just taking in the scenery here. Bob's shooting a little video over there. But this is the build site, guys. This is uh, this is where all the the magic is happening. Five rigs being built out. Five new homes. For deserving, needing people, it's going to be awesome. Day two, I'm a day late and a dollar short, but I'm sure glad to be here. Just getting started. Cargo trailer, minivan. Picked up supplies at Home Depot, and pretty soon I won't be able to show you what's going on because once the work's done, it's going to be on Bob's video. Now the heavy lifting, getting the stuff off. Lots of people here. That's the tab trailer. It's going to. Lift gates are nice. The people and facilities here are really quite impressive. Five rigs build, being built out, but man, any tool it could need, tents, 30 volunteers, things are going to come together. That is my opinion.